Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Joe back again for Ash and Ember. And Jordan. And Jordan, Ash and yeah, well. with Ash and Ember as well. We're gonna make this quick little announcement. We're gonna have a grand opening. We ba, waited. Ba, 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 ba. Yes, this is gorgeous, man. Thank you. Very you're like, good. You know, you're like a little like a town crier. Uh, we're gonna do this grand opening. Uh, and it's taken a while for us to do a grand opening because we wanted to wait on a few things. The number one thing, we're gonna put in a, a big humidor here uh, and we're gonna stock it with like thousands of cigars. We have a really small humidor right now and it's really pathetic and I'm sick of dealing with it. So that's exciting, but we wanted to kind of give back to the community, you know, and show people appreciation for supporting the shop for these four months. Uh, we're gonna have door prizes every hour of the day uh, we're gonna have a crawfish boil, a Cajun, you know, sucking juice out of crawfish heads and just throwing them at people. It'll be awesome. Uh, we're gonna have some sort of sweets, cakes or cupcakes or something. Hopefully Live bands. Do what? Hopefully all of the sweets. Hopefully all the sweets for me, because I'm just a sugar holic. We're gonna have live bands. Uh, Dead Indian is playing. I'm pretty excited about that. Great local band. Great local band. And then uh, somebody else is playing. It's kind of a secret. It's a secret announcement. I, I tried to get uh, Richard Simmons and Weird Al Yankovic to come down here. Richard Simmons was really cheap, uh, but it turns out that he was on this uh, boat cruise. Uh, he couldn't make it. Uh, and uh, Weird Al's way, way above our price range. Uh, but anyway, it's August 30th, which is on a Saturday. Uh, starts at about 10 o'clock, goes to, I don't know, you know whenever we Till whenever, yeah. So whenever yeah. all the crawfish has to get eaten. Yeah, man, all the crawfish has to get eaten, uh, and then we'll, uh, you know, ri ritualistically sacrifice small forest animal for the continued success of the shop. You know, that's how Led Zeppelin succeeded. Did you know that? I didn't. They used to sacrifice squirrels and chipmunks, a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, it's scary, but uh, you know, we'll do that. You know, that'll be after dark. The sacrifices. So stick around for the sacrifices and uh, join us at Action Number. Thanks, guys. Thanks.